Lindsay, hearing that uh, story just before um, taking a look at the weather here at home, there's so much weather action happening across parts of the country. We saw out happening in the East Coast, floods and rain, something that we're not, you know, that was something that we've seen in the past earlier this year, and then high heat in parts of the South. Yeah, I mean, I know that I'm super familiar with that high heat and you are too, Anna. I know from where you lived before. So triple digits, not too fun, but we're not seeing triple digits over here. Let's take a look at our camera at Dominico's on the wharf. We already had sunrise and a little bit earlier, I was seeing some otters out there. I don't think that they're there anymore, but they were hanging out right there and they were being super cute and adorable. So I wish they would have come back for our, um, the weather hit, but that's okay. Well, we see a boat coming in here looking at pretty serene waters a boat starting off their morning. We have some low clouds and fog hanging out over here. So let's see what those clouds will be doing for the rest of the day. Let's take a look at our future cast. Those clouds will be moving a little bit downward towards the big shore coast in Monterey as we go into the afternoon. As we go into the evening, the clouds will push a little bit more into the valleys over here and to the Monterey area as well. And as we go into the morrow, those clouds will start moving a little bit more inward along the coast in the Watsonville and Salinas area and coming a little bit into the Salinas Valley as well. But let's take a look at our temperatures for today and tonight. Starting on the Santa Cruz coast, looking at Santa Cruz and Capitola, we'll be looking at temperatures in our low 70s for those highs. And for our lows, we'll be looking at temperatures in the low 50s. In Santa Cruz, we'll be looking at a high of 71 degrees and in Capitola, a high of 72 degrees and lows of 53 degrees in Santa Cruz and 54 degrees in Capitola. And as you go into the Santa Cruz Mountains, that is when it's going to start getting a little bit warmer as we will be looking at 82 degrees in Boulder Creek over there and 51 degrees and Boulder Creek is that low and temperatures in the Santa Cruz Mountains will be similar to those in the 80s and some in the high 70s and the low 50s for those lows. Let's take a look at our temperatures going from Aptos all the way to the marinas. That's where it's going to get cooler as we go down the coast looking at a temperature 70 degrees in Watsonville is that high and 53 degrees is that low and Marina and Castroville we're looking at a little bit of lower temperatures on that coast of highs of 61 or 63 degrees in both of those cities and 52 degrees in Castroville and Marina. And as you go inland again, that is where things are going to start getting warmer as we will be hitting 84 degrees up in Morgan Hill is that high and 54 degrees as that low. And if you want to see cooler temperatures, head on over to the peninsula. That's where it's going to be a bit cooler out there where you'll need your jackets today. So looking at temperatures in Pacific Grove, we'll be looking at a high of 64 degrees and a low of 53 degrees and in Pebble Beach looking at a high 61 degrees and a low 52 degrees with temperatures around the peninsula being pretty similar all the way throughout the board. Now let's take a look at temperatures going all the way from Big Sur to Carmel Valley. We're going to be looking on the Big Sur coast at a high of 66 degrees and a low of 56 degrees and Carmel Valley looking at a high of 69 degrees and a low of 52 degrees. And as we go down into the Carmel Valley, that's when things are going to start getting warmer as we're hitting 82 degrees is that high in King City and 54 degrees is that low. And as we move inland, we'll be hitting 90s. Yes, some 90s. So if you're hanging out inland today, please make sure you're doing everything to stay hydrated and stay away from that heat as much as you can. Looking at 93 degrees in Parkland and Parkfield, excuse me, right there is that high 55 degrees as that low. Let's take a look at what the rest of the week's going to look like in our coastal areas. We're going to be having a warm up. Our temperatures are going to be starting to get up into the high 60s, looking at 69 degrees as that high on Saturday and our lows being anywhere from the low to mid 50s and looking at our inland areas. That's where things are going to start getting warmer as we will be hitting 90 degrees on Saturday as that high with some winds and breeze as the week goes on and looking at our lows being anywhere in the mid 50s to low 60s.